السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته Your Miss Teacher Mr. Hussain with you We will talk about our lesson today about the area of a circle <coughs> But before starting our lesson We must remember some definitions about the circle Firstly we will talk about the radius What is the meaning of a radius lens? The radius lens is the line segment which join between two points First point is a center of the circle and second point on the surface of the circle so this line segment we call it radius and this also radius and this also radius and this also radius okay <coughs> what about diameter diameter it's a line segment that join between two points on the surface of the circle but must be but must be passing through the center of the circle so this line segment we call it diameter but we have <coughs> a new definitions like circular sector it's a part of a circle which consists of an arc and two radii passing through the two ends of this arc like if we have an arc like this okay and from the two ends of this arc we draw two radii so this part we call it circular sector so the circular sector it's a line segment that consists of an arc and the two radii passing through the ends of this arc okay <clears throat> now we will talk about our lesson today about the area of a circle but we must remember that what is the meaning of circumference of a circle the circumference of the circle is the outer length of this shape the outer length of this shape okay and if we talking about the area that's meaning the inner space inside this shape the inner <coughs> space inside this shape like in the shaded bars okay now we will make a revision about the mathematical symbols we talked before like the radius it's a symbol is r diameter d circumference c area a and we take before pi equal to 2 over 7 and approximate it to 3.14 that's a constant value that's constant value you must give it now we will talk about the formula we take before firstly we take diameter equal to r radius equal d divided to circumference equal 2 by r and the newcomer is area equal by r square and we can extract a formula from the previous formulas r equal c divided 2 pi <coughs> okay you must keep this formulas okay and we will put behind us now let's solve some exercise about the area of a circle and its circumference like the following he gave me a circle and he asked me to find its area now we will write the data you have radius length equal 5 cm and he asked me to find <coughs> its circumference and its area before starting anything you must write your formula circumference equal to 
by r now we will substitute to multiply oh sorry he said consider pi equals 3.14 so we will write 3.14 by r equal 5 centimeter okay that will be equal 78.8 okay that will be equal sorry to multiply 3.14 multiply 5 centimeter that's equal 31.4 what about its area by r square now we will substitute 3.14 okay multiply 5 power 2 that's equal 78.5 centimeter square don't forget its unit please now in this example he gave me the diameter length equal 8 centimeter but you must have its radius length radius length equal d divided 2 equal 8 divided 2 equal 4 centimeter now we will find its area because we have its radius length <coughs> area equal by r square equal 3.14 multiply 4 power 2 okay that's equal 50.24 centimeter square okay that's a directly questions there is no problem in it what about if he give me like this questions if the radius length of a circle is 10 centimeter find its area and its circumference consider 3 by equal 3.14 okay now we will collecting the data which we have he gave me the radius length equal 10 centimeter and he asked me to find its circumference and its area but we must consider by equal 3.14 <coughs> okay we firstly we will find its circumference equal 2 by r you must write your formula please to multiply 3.14 multiply okay that will be equal 314 uh, sorry that will be equal 16 2.8 centimeter what about its area write the formula by r square 3.14 multiply 10 power 2 3.14 by 100 equal 314 centimeter square okay <coughs> next question if the diameter length of a circle equal 14 centimeter yes you have diameter length equal 14 centimeter and its area find sorry find its area area equal and its circumference we don't know but he must consider by equal 22 over 7 firstly we must have its radius length we said before it's a president it's the most important part in anything about the circle if you have it you can get anything belongs to this circle <coughs> we take before radius length equal d divided 2 diameter equal 14 divided 2 equal 7 centimeter yes you have radius length equal 7 centimeter so you can find its circumference equal write the formula please to multiply by multiply r <coughs> 2 by 22 over 7 multiply 7 that's equal 44 centimeter area equal by r square 22 over 7 multiply 7 
power 2 that's equal 144 centimeter square okay there is no problem in this questions it's a directly it's a direct question there is no difficult what about this questions You will have two ways to find this answer. Firstly, we will use formula. Which we take it. Firstly, we must collect the data. If the circumference of a circle equal C equal. 88 find its area consider by equal 22 over 7 okay we said before the most important part in our lesson today is the radius length if you can get the radius length you find anything belongs to the circle we take before here radius length equal by divided 2 by R equal C divided to pi. Okay, we can write it R equal C divided to pi. Substitute 88 divided 2 multiply 22 over. <coughs> over 7, that's equal. 14 centimeter okay you have radius length so we can get area area equal by r square substitute 22 over 7 multiply 14 power 2 that's equal 616 centimeter square there is no problem in this part what about if you want use the equation to find the value of radius length and then you can get the area please try to solve any question belong to this part by using the equation it's an important way now we said we have circumference equal 88 area you don't have <coughs> by equal 22 over 7 and you don't have the radius length firstly I will look at your data which symbol you have its value yes we have circumference equal 88 can you write its formula yes we can C equal 2 by R okay any symbol you have its value please please write it down do you have the value of c yes equal 80 8 write equal down 2 it's a number write it down multiply by equal 22 over 7 multiply r now we can solve this equation to find the value of r okay can we simplify this part yes we can 88 equal 44 over 7 multiply r we said before if we have a fraction multiply by the variable or unknown the unknown value which we want find it in the equation we will take this fraction to the other side also multiply but we will change we will change the position r equal 88 multiply 7 divided 44 that's equal 14 centimeter okay divided 1 44 divided 44 equal 1 88 divided 44 equal 2 2 multiply 7 equal 14 4 okay <coughs> you can also use the calculator now we have radius length equal 14 centimeter so we can get its area area equal by r square 22 over 7 multiply 14 power 2 that's also 16 
centimeter square yes that's too long but that's but this way it's too important it's too important please try by yourself in this question now this question unusually you find in exams but this questions help me to find the answer by using this equation okay if the area of a circle equal 616 yes we have area equal 616 find its circumference he asked me to find its circumference equal what consider by 22 over 7 okay <coughs> now we have the value of area do you have a formula for this yes we have area equal pi r square okay Put, write down the value of any symbol you have do you have the value of area yes write it down 616 equal go down by equal 22 over 7 multiply okay by r power 2 your variable is r power 2 okay what are you doing we will take this fraction to the other side and change their position multiply so r power 2 equal 616 multiply 7 divided 22 okay <coughs> that's equal 196 centimeter but there is a problem here that's r power 2 you can ask yourself what is the number which we multiply by itself give you 196 we said before r power 2 equal r by r equal 196 okay if you multiply 14 by 14 you will find 196 so r equal 14 centimeter or you can use a new you can use a new way to find the radius length by using the root by using the root you don't take it before you can use it so r equal root 196 you can find it in your calculator here root 196 okay that's equal 14 centimeter so the root help me to find the number which we multiply by itself give you this number so that's equal 14 centimeter so this sign is called root okay now you have radius length equal 14 centimeter can you get its circumference yes we can c equal 2 by r 2 multiply 22 over 7 by 14 that's equal 88 centimeter please again area equal 616 c equal question mark by equal 22 over 7 which number which value you have we have the area equal 616 can you write its formula yes area equal by r square okay write down the value of any number you which you have area equal 616 equal 22 over 7 multiply r power 2 can you solve this equation yes we can we take this fraction to another side multiply also but we will change the position r power 2 that's the remainder in this part in this side sorry 616 multiply 7 divided 200 uh, 22 sorry 7 over 22 equal 196 centimeter now we have r power 2 if you want the number which we multiply by itself to get 196 you can use the root you can use 
the root it's the easy way it's easy way r equal root 196 equal 14 centimeter next we can get circumference circumference equal to pi r <coughs> equal to multiply 22 over 7 by 14 that will be equal 88 centimeter okay there is another two ideas this question talking about the sector which we talk about before <coughs> in the opposite figure a circle m of a radius four centimeter is divided into five equal circular sector calculate the surface area of one sector pi equal 22 over 7 or 3.14 as you like you can use anyone okay now the only way to solve this question we must find the area of this circle can you get it yes but we said before we must write the data which we have yes we have the radius length equal four something meter and you said this circle divided into five equal circular sectors okay yeah uh, we have five sectors okay the answer follow my step please okay area of circle equal by r square okay 22 over 7 multiply 4 power 2 okay that's equal Fifty point twenty eight. That's approximated. Okay. Now we can find the area of one sector. Area one sector equal area of a circle divided five. We said before this circle divided into five equal parts. Five equal sectors okay so the to the only way to find the area of one sector you must divide the area of all the circle by five <coughs> okay fifty point twenty eight divided five that's equal ten point zero five centimeter square and that's centimeter square okay the last idea which we have in the opposite figure ABC is a rectangle its lens okay now we are collecting the data L equal 12 centimeter and its width W equal 7 centimeter and a circle drawn to touch the sides A D and BC calculate the area of the shaded part that shaded part okay but we have a problem here you don't have the radius lens or you don't have any data about the circle but we can use transformation to find the lens of this diameter of the circle you can translate this line segment here so this line segment equal this line segment this equal seven and this equal seven so the width equal the diameter okay can you find it's a radius length yes we can the only way to find the area of the shaded part you must find the area of all of the rectangle next find the area of this circle then subtract them okay firstly we will get area of rectangle write the formula please length by width 7 by 
12 that's equal 84 centimeter square area of circle equal pi r square do you know you have diameter equal 7 centimeter so radius length equal 7 divided 2 equal 3.5 so 22 over 7 by equal 22 over 7 he said this by 3.5 power 2 okay that's equal 38.5 centimeter square if you want the area of shaded part no problem area shaded equal area of rectangle minus area of circle area of rectangle 84 minus 38.5 Okay, that's equal 45.5 centimeter square. Okay. Okay. You have length equal 12 centimeter and width equal 7 centimeter. We get translate the side length to be a diameter here equal 7 centimeter and radius equal 7 over 2 equals 3.5 centimeter firstly we can get area of rectangle equal length by what 7 by 12 equal 84 centimeter square area of the circle equal pi r square equal 22 over 7 multiplies 3.5 power 2 equal 338.5 centimeter square area shaded equal area of rectangle minus the area of a circle equal 84 minus 38.5 that's equal 45.5 okay please try in your home to answer this question by yourself and i will attach this sheet with this video okay uh, be attention you must consider that the most important part in this circle is radius length if you can get it you can find anything belongs to this circle okay please try to solve any question by using the equation like this questions like this questions you must bracket you must bracket in this way thank you goodbye